like you ever felt. Are you listening? Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Hey guys. Uh, I just came up a flight of stairs, so I'm breathing hard. Anyways, so there was a deal at my local toy store, which is Tom's Toys. Um, that's where I usually get my brat horses. I don't usually get them at a tax store because I don't have a tax store near me. I mean, there's, in, there's one maybe like an hour away, but I'm not going an hour away just to get a horse. Unless there's a special occasion where I have to go over there. So, let me get to the point. I got... So, well, let me explain. Okay. Well, so, we, me and my mom, went to Tom's Toys, and we, we looked at a sign. It said, if you get one large barn, then you get two briar horses free. So, I did that. And I got a big deluxe barn. It was expensive, yes it was, but I got it, and I am going to love it. I'm not going to open it because I'm pretty sure I have to assemble it just by the shape of the box. So, and then, we remodeled, if you can tell. God, this thing is big. Um, yeah. Now, yes, it was just Halloween. I'm still getting to my Halloween, uh, Halloween video, but I needed these briar horses for the video. So I got Nightmare, which I've been wanting forever, but my mom absolutely hates Halloween horses. So it was hard to convince her, but I finally convinced her to get this. Oh, you can see my flexion. Hey guys. So I really like this guy. I've been wanting him forever since last year, which I believe since he came out. I know it is a bit weird looking. Like personally, I like it, but it's a little bit on the dark side. But this is why I like Ichabod better. I like Ichabod better because he just looks a lot better. This this guy has a lot of crap going on in his, like just too much detail with the art, but I like this guy because it's just one thing. It's just like, skulls, which I love. Um, I love the little pumpkins at the bottom. <laughs> I love the bats on this one. But anyways, I'm gonna get started to opening these guys and I absolutely love these guys. The price for these guys, Ichabod was $60 at Tom's Toys, and Nightmare was uh, $50 at Tom's Toys, and yeah. Also, if you look at the top, this is the main reason why my mom especially didn't want this one, is because there's like graveyards and blood on it. But she was more willing to get this one because it's just green with pumpkins and stuff. So yeah, I, I, I can't understand with this one. It's a bit, like, you could say it's a bit um, PG-13. That's how I'm going to explain it. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna get started to opening these guys. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, I got them out and I absolutely love these guys. Look at them, they're amazing. Okay, so let me, let me just test something. Uh, let me get it, let's see. It's obvious which one's which. Whoa, okay, this is cool. Whoa, okay, the camera really can't see them. Like closer, maybe, 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 no, okay. Okay, well, let's see. Uh, I'm gonna try it up here. This, we're gonna do Ichabod first. We're gonna see this. This works. Okay, you really 
It, I can see it glowing fine, like perfectly fine. But you guys just can't see it. Okay, freaking. Whatever. <laughs> they glow amazing. I love them how they glow. Okay, let's try this again. Just keep looking. You can you can see it a little bit. Just a little, just a little bit. Just a little bit. But I really adore these guys. These guys are absolutely amazing. So I'm gonna interview one of them at a time. Right now I'm gonna be interviewing the old, older one, Nightmare 2014. I don't know what the mold's called, but I really love this mold. I don't have this mold, so this is completely new to me. He is a mare. Oh, uh, I'm gonna go read its box real quick. Okay, I checked out her box, and it is a girl. Okay, what the heck? I just got the message. <sighs> Nightmare. Get it, people? Get it? Okay, anyways, I'm gonna start interviewing her. Now, the thing I... So, these are the things I like about her. Now... I love it how she glows in the dark. I love her, love her eyes. I love her eyes very much. I love her fangs. Her fangs are really cool. They're unique. Um, I don't know. Oh, I'm happy that the stand didn't come apart from it because then I'd have to like undo all the. Uh, you you guys kind of get the point. Probably not. Um, I like how. I don't know. I really like her. I love it all. I love it how she's black and white. I mean, obviously she has to be black and white, but like 2004 horse was like all completely gray. I want to get that one. Yes, I do. But anyways, let me continue about her. Um, what I hate about this mare though is there's actually a few things I don't like about it. Um, I don't like this. This art piece just really freaks me out. Like, give me nightmares, freaky. Um, the vampire is great, but it's, I don't know. I feel like there's way too much art on this horse. I, I just feel like there's way too much art. I love the horse, but there's too much art on it. I wish it would just, it was just black and white with a few bats on it. Um, I like the haunted house. I really like this little house with the tree and stuff. I really like that. Let me zoom up on the things that I'm talking about. I love this little house right here. I love the mane and tail and forelock. Tail. Love its hooves. I love pretty much everything about this mare except for there's this and this that really freak me out. So... That is te technically all I have for this one. And wait, it's really <laughs> creepy in front. <laughs> look at that, look at that. It's so weird, but I like it. I like it besides those things. Now for Ichabod, which is really cool. I really like Ichabod. There's nothing, I, I don't, like, I love this horse. This is probably my favorite out of the two. Um. Ichabod is a stallion, obviously he's in the stallion, the rearing stallion mold. Uh, he's, a, yes, a stallion, his balls are pink. It's not very nightmare-y, but I guess they want to put some texture and realness to it. I love the markings that it has. I just love these markings. This marking, I adore. I just love... The marking on this horse, this mark, I love it. <laughs> I just love it. Uh, I like the hooves that are that they're striped. That's really cool to me. I love the skulls on it all over the place, and I love the little tiny specks telling it's Napaloosa. I love how the tail blends into like it's black and then white and then black, and then it has like the Halloween 2015 thing on it. Same with Nightmare. Nightmare has it, but it's on her belly. Nightmare 2014. Uh, so, yeah. 
I really like this horse. I love the eyes are really cool. I really love the eyes. You can really tell this horse is in distress and stuff. So yeah. Now the things that I dislike about this horse, there's not a lot of things that I usually dislike about horses, but the mane I believe is a bit short. I would love it if the mane was a little bit longer and I don't know, I really like long manes. Like he could use more of the long mane thing. That's actually it. Like I love the whole thing. I love it. Oh, I also wish that the mouth could be like open, just completely open. That would be really cool if they added that. But that's all that I just like about this horse. So it's obvious that I really like this guy. I like this guy a lot better than Nightmare. So Okay, so the fact that I got two new Halloween horses, I am going to now tell you guys what I'm gonna be doing for Halloween video. I know, Halloween was like a few days ago. I know, and I'm really sorry I didn't put up a video earlier. But I, but if you guys have been with me for a while, you know that sometimes I skip holidays, which Halloween isn't really a holiday, but in Mexican culture it is. But you guys kinda get what I mean. But I love these guys. So, I think I'm going to try to the, do a time lapse for this, this thing. Okay. Has to be level. I, I'm going to see if I can put this thing together. So, I guess I'm going to attempt to open this barn. So, I know I, did, I said I wouldn't, but I think I'm just going to at least try to attempt it. So, and get these guys out of the way. Let's start. Okay, guys, so I just got it open. What? Got my scissors. I need my scissors. My kitty scissors. Couldn't find any other scissors, so. Just gonna have to deal with it. Okay, so I didn't find any instructions, which is unfortunate, but I think they're in here. Oh yeah, no, they're in here. <laughs> they're in here, thank God. Whoa, tons of instruction thingamabobbers. Okay, we've got screws. Um. I don't know what this is, but I guess I need it. Uh, it looks like we've got, I don't know, these look like extra, oh wait, no, never mind. These aren't extra pieces. So, uh, we've got a lot of smaller pieces here I might wanna be careful with. Now, last time I built a barn. Now, this was the barn I built. I was kind of playing around over here. I built this barn with my dad. Now this is a deluxe barn. My dad isn't here and he doesn't know I got this. My mom wants to keep this a secret from him for a while, just because it was really expensive. <sighs> so I'm gonna try to build this by myself because my dad is actually a construction worker. So it's really easy with him. <gasps> there's a little water trough, that's so cute. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm getting carried away. Oh my gosh, there's this. What is this? I guess I'm gonna find out soon. <laughs> uh, this is cool. But let's, we'll find out very soon. Let's get started, shall we? Okay, uh, really, I just made a mess. Because if I can't put this together, this is gonna be a really bad mess. And um, I wanna get in trouble, but I'm gonna do this anyways because I'm an idiot. So, uh, how about we get started? I sorted all my people. No, I didn't. I barely sorted my pieces out. <laughs> Let's do this anyways. <laughs> okay, so that wasn't really building. I was just kind of 
get in the feel for things. Uh, this is really hard. I can't figure most of the things out, but I'm gonna try anyways, and I just realized I need a freaking screwdriver. Everything was moved around, so I don't really know where anything is. I know I have a screwdriver up here. Like, for a fact. Okay, never mind. I don't know for a fact. And I don't think I have it up here anymore, but I'm gonna carefully go around here. I was applying a lot. Yeah, never mind. I don't have a screwdriver up here. So, okay, that's great. So, I'm gonna go get a screwdriver in the laundry room real quick. And then we'll see if I can hopefully get this mess under control. Okay, I got my screwdriver. So, I'm gonna get started now. Okay, guys, I just realized I just grabbed one of the pieces. Look at that crap. That is bullshit. Um, I'm gonna deal with it and do it anyways. I'm probably gonna put something over that, but that really pisses me off that this thing was about $200 um, plus Ichabod, I had to pay a extra $10 because they specifically said $50, like you can get a barn and two free horses, but the both horses have to be under $50, but Ichabod was $60 and Nightmare was 50 so I had to pay an extra $10, but that's not my point. This thing was really expensive, like $200, $200 this was, and this is what I get. That really pisses me off. That, you know what, it's not that bad, so I'm gonna deal with it, but let's get started. Actually started. 